Hello, Leslie here, Run With Craft Scissors. We're gonna go ahead and do another cozy winter plane with me. This one is from Planner Sister Stickers, and it's called Winter Breeze, and it does feature some hockey aspects. Um, I don't particularly watch hockey, but I like pink and green in winter together, so there you go. So let's go ahead and get started using this kit. I did go ahead and put my date covers down and my bottom washi. Um, I feel like that just kinda like cuts down on a little bit of time um, when I'm trying to film. So we do need to decide what we're going to use. I really like the snowman. <laughs> um, his little hat matches my little winter hat a little bit. So I kind of want to use that. Um, and then I don't think I'm going to use this one. I think I'll use that one. So it's going to be a heavy double box kit. Cause I just, I feel like both girls is kind of redundant, but it is pretty, but I feel like this one, you get to see more of the trees and the lake. So I think that's what I'm going to do. We're still going to use those half boxes, but I think we'll go ahead and put this long double box one in. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and do it this way. We do have glitter headers, so mine as well. But I really like the snowman, so <laughs> that's why we're doing it. I I mentioned in my other video, like we just haven't had that snow that's been like a fun snow, so it's been somewhat disappointing, but we've had snow days. They just haven't, we just bake because <laughs> there's nothing else to do really. Okay, so we have these two girls, and um, this one has a coffee cup, so I thought that one would be a fun one to use. I think I'm going to grab this one, and I'm going to stick it um, probably up here because... Then I'm going to have one down here. I'll have my theme sticker down there. And then this other scene, there's two other scene stickers, actually. So I could do this one here and this one here and then none of the other ones. So that's kind of sad because <laughs> I said that, like, I don't, I don't mind including hockey. So I kind of want to include one. But then the scenes kind of prevent me from doing that. So I'm trying to decide what to do here because I like the scenes. I do. Okay, we're probably going to skip this one then all together. I really just like the by the bonfire. Oh, but I do like the trees. There's trees in this one too. Oh, man. Am I picking the wrong one, you guys? <laughs> Y'all going to yell at me? <laughs> I hope not. Okay, we're going to go ahead and stick this one here in the middle. And then it was just like a big debate on whether I wanted to have three scenes how many scenes is too many in a plane with me I mean we have those planner sticker kits out there that like the whole page is like a scene so <laughs> doesn't matter <laughs> um I'm not in love with the car though that's for sure it's kind of like Meh. okay so maybe we do um hockey right here and then oop can I have this thanks their stickers are very removable friendly, and I'm notorious for putting stickers down crooked, so it's helpful. Um, I think I'm going to stick this one. I'm trying to decide which half of the house I like the best. I think I like this half. I was thinking maybe as my theme sticker, like going into like the location of the cabin. I thought that would be kind of cool. I don't know. I mean, we got to figure this out, but... I think it's a cute one to use for that. And then we can grab this treat pile and put that down here. I'm going to spread things out. And I think that's how it's going to look for the full boxes. I was like, I'm just not in love with the car and, like, the stuff being in the trunk. Like, I don't know. I was just like, it's cute if you're planning. If you are planning on traveling here and you're like, I'm going to pack this day, then that sticker would totally work for you. You know what I'm saying? But... For me, not so much. Okay, let's decide on where our full box checklists are going to go. <sighs> so I think I'm going to put, I could do checklist, 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 and then that would make sure that nothing is near the other ones. So I think that is my best bet. I didn't really want to put another full box checklist next to the double, the two full boxes here. So I thought that would be a good way to kind of split it up a little bit. I do have washi tape picked out. 
Um, have I ever gone to like a place like this? Yes. Growing up, we uh, went to Tahoe to see snow because I grew up in Northern California, in case you guys didn't know. Um, <laughs> so where I lived, we didn't have snow but or a beach, but we could easily drive to one. I feel like I'm going to sneeze. <coughs> So sorry, you guys. Hope I caught most of that one before. I, I mean, I hope I caught it <laughs> and muted. Okay, so this one, like I said, I think I'm going to put this one up here just because I'm trying to avoid putting half boxes, putting full box checklists right all next to each other. Did I just grab the wrong sticker? Yes, yes, you did, girl. It's okay. You sneezed. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so we're still going to put this up here. <laughs> we're still going to do that. All right, and then this one is going to come down here. Ooh, don't love that. I don't love that. Because I'm going to end up putting both of my checklists here, so I don't want a checklist here. So we're going to have to drop that down. We are, actually. It's just the way I want it to look. You know, it's your planner, you do you. Maybe you don't use all the checklists and half boxes. That's totally fine. There are times where I look at my spread and I'm like, I only wrote down like one thing on that checklist. Like I didn't really need a full checklist. But if it's your planner aesthetic that you want your planner to look a certain way, which is how I am, then make it look a certain way. I mean, I feel like the first month in our planner is all of us just trying to figure out if like this is the planner for me. Am I being successful in it? Those kinds of things. How's my year going? Um, do I like looking at it this particular way? Those kinds of things. Okay, we're going to put to do on top of those. Actually, we're going to put many things. I did this in another spread last week too. I'm going to skip the to do's. It's very dark green. I feel like I have a lot of green. I want to bring in this tan color and that today really fits my half box, like what I put in half boxes. So I don't want to change that. I also think it's funny I did two winter spreads in a row from two different shops and they both had like accents of light pink <laughs> which have totally worked out with going with my my new nails so that works. Works for me. Anyway so I hope I don't mess anybody up by using different headers but I feel like I never use many things or the odds and ends or like whatever else the third header that people <laughs> tend to change their names on. To me, I feel like I would, I don't know, like, I usually tend to lean towards to do or um, today. It's just what I do. But I feel like it's a no-brainer that, like, you're doing this today, but it's just something to put on there, I guess. We should think of other phrases for headers. What do you guys put? Um, I will say I used to track, like, Food, diet, and exercise. I've done that before. And um, that makes me use different headers for sure. Okay, half boxes. Let's grab this one first. And then I like to go ahead and put mine all the way to the top um, and line it up with the header. It's just easier because then I don't feel like I have to cover up the lines. Um, I have before, like, bounced around. Um, but I tend not to, like, to you to have, like, I call it useless lines. There's functional lines and then there's useless lines. <laughs> and I feel like when those are exposed, it's not a line I'm writing on, therefore it's a useless line. <laughs> and I don't like it. I do like to color block in my plan with me's. Do you guys like to color block in your plan with me's? If you're a full kit planner, that would be interesting to know. Someone is driving really weird at my street. Like some kind of weird vehicle or something. I don't know. It's like a really low motor. <laughs> so that's kind of throwing me off. I did drink a lot of coffee this morning. Um, and I haven't eaten anything yet. So that's probably not a good mix. But I will try to eat something before I leave to go to the grocery store. Which I need to do like as soon as possible after this. I feel like I've been up since 7. But there is never... And there's never enough time, you guys. Do you ever feel that way? It's just never enough time to get all the things done that I need to do. But I also, I'm a person that tends to, like, stretch myself pretty thin. <laughs> like, 
I'm trying to film videos and do my laundry and um, I had to get my stuff done for the online school this morning and fill orders. Like I try to do all of those things, which is why moving new releases to every other week was just, it was a half to honestly. I know these two half boxes are up here together, but we're just going to not care about that because they're on separate pages. I don't know. And then a lot of the time, these kinds of boxes end up looking that way. I skipped this one because it just didn't pop up. And I was like, we'll just keep going. If I have to go back and get it, I'll get it. But I don't think I'll need to. Usually there's like one extra, kind of like for the mini things, which always throws me off when there's like one extra. I'm always like looking like, where did I forget to put that down? Just me? <laughs> Um, I didn't build my first snowman until I was like 17 um, <laughs> because the snow in Tahoe was pretty compacted unless you went like while it was snowing. Um, and so it wasn't, you weren't able to really make a snowman out of it. It was really funny because I was piling up all the snow thinking that that's how you make a snowman. And my mom was like, no, 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 don't do that. You're ruining the snow because you have to like roll it and pack it, which I did not know how to do. So I think once again, I'm going to go with that pink glitter just to bring that in because I went with the beige and the green for my other um, word headers. There's word headers and glitter headers. I don't think I usually call them word headers, but I'm making it up as I go along. You know. Ooh, that is cute. I like that pink. And I even did pink glitter on the headers on the other spread. That's so funny. And then I, sh so I should have obviously this plan with me up and then I did film a haul video so that should go up this week as well. Um, last week I did still have three videos, but it was like a pin review, a haul video, and my new releases video. I didn't have any plan with me. So if you're like, what did I miss? Um, I'm going to go ahead and this is coming after that one. But I will upload the week before this is playing with me. Um, I'm going to go ahead and post it on Sunday. So if you missed it, it went up on Sunday. So you can go back and check that out if you want. Um, I'll try to remember to put it in like an iCard or a video suggestion in this video to try to help you guys out in case you're like, what, what are you talking about? What, what plan with me? <laughs> so we're a little out of order and yeah, the happy planner dashboard plan with me's haven't been coming through and I'm afraid I'm repeating my behavior from last year's plan with me's <laughs> now I get them done. So this week is not a new release week. Um, which also means I don't really need a ton of room in my sidebar, but I am going to go ahead. Obviously, I need to start planning um, my shop anniversary sale. I need to start planning these things way ahead of time just because I have a lot going on, so it's better if I do things ahead of time. So I'm going to go ahead and put this week's orders. So if you order, your little tally number goes on the day that you ordered, which is fun. And then I think that's it for this one. Um, I think I'm just going to put Etsy, I'll still put the Etsy header and then I'll kind of write like what I, what I really focused on for this week. I think I'm done with those and I'm done with this and then payday for Etsy is on Tuesdays. So I'll put that sticker in. Um, I'm going to mail orders tomorrow. So I'll use that little envelope and then. This plan with me will go up normal on Thursday. So I'm going to go ahead and just put this one here. And then, let's see. I don't think there's anything else that really, like, goes in this planner. The trash can. We usually put the trash out on Wednesday nights. And I think that's pretty much it for functionals for me. And then there is this one, but I don't have room for that. So that goes in the stash pile. So does that one. There is deco, but I want to add in some washi tape first before I go into that. Um, I do have some, oh goodness, it's green. <laughs> it's green and pine, there we go. I want this one. I feel like that washi is definitely a good one for this kit. And then you struggle with like, is this one good or is this one too much? So then I have some rose gold snowflake, which I thought would go good with that tan. I do have some green plaid. Um, in case I need to make that a little bit wider, I thought that would be good as well. And then I don't, I don't really see anything else. Like I don't have, do I, I, my pink Christmas washi is not wintry. It is Christmassy. And I always feel like it never seems to go perfectly with my spreads or the pink washi has 
way other colors involved and it just looks silly. So I think these are my washi choices. I might grab a silver winter one, we'll see. So we're gonna start off with this winter Christmas tree one. Cause I do have like no washi on this side, like that very much anyway. So I really don't need too many washi choices. But I thought if I wanted to, there we go, put that down. If I wanted to use, there is some deco girls that are kind of a little bit bigger. So we might be incorporating those as well. But I thought these two together might actually be kind of cute. Or I should just do them separately. I was trying to decide. I think we'll do them together. I might just do deco on this girl right here. This girl. <laughs> this box. I might put a girl. <laughs> One of the girl deco stickers. That came out all sorts of wrong, didn't it? That's hilarious. I told you I haven't eaten anything. <laughs> I know. It's my fault. I know. There's just like, there's like food to reheat. There's nothing really like ready to go. So that's on me. I wonder if that would look cute going across there. It probably would, but I'm going to stack it, kind of space it, stack it. Um, I think the rose gold snowflake and the plaid, I think are from Hobby Lobby. I can't remember. Okay. And then, like I said, this one we're going to put over here. Kind of match that one. And then we're pretty much done with washi. That's why I was like, I'm not going to stress over it. We don't need a ton of it. It's not necessary. But I do like this rose gold with that those tan boxes. I just thought it looked kind of cool. I know there's gold at the bottom. And I do feel like rose gold goes better with the gold than like grabbing. A lot of my snowflake washi is silver accented. So there is that. Okay, as far as other girls, I try to see like what girls I already have on my planner. Okay, so she's here. She's here, and then one that's not on here. So I'm between the blonde and I think that's gray. She's a little bigger, so I think I'm going to pick her just because she's a little taller, and I think it would look cooler. Yeah. Yeah, I like that a lot. Okay, so that looks good there. And then um, as far as, like, I like this tall one with the thermos and the cocoa. I'm going to stick that right here because, like I said, I'm not going to have too much to write there, so I think it's fine if I do that. Um, we want to put little deco when there's, like, no space. Um, so we'll grab this one and then, like, maybe the new planner as a present. That would be kind of fun there. In case I want to put planner, plan with me deco or something, I don't want anything too much in the way. We'll put this one here. It's got some food on it. And then we'll put the little green mittens on this one and then we'll put the hat and hat and scarf if I can get it this one's really detailed yeah okay right here I think that looks good okay do I want to put any more deco next to this girl I feel like I should but I'm not sure what it should be the planner presents or notebook and letter I think we'll just do the planner present. I think right there. That'll work. Okay. So we're good on that. I have some girl study stash there. But I'm like, yay, my spread is done. <laughs> That's how I'm feeling about this. <laughs> okay, we'll put this little snowflake bow over here. I did have a pink sparkly bow that I thought would be kind of fun. It's kind of a bright pink. It's a bright light pink is what I would call it. So there's that one. And then I want to put my pink snowy hat on there. And then I'm loving my polar bear. I also grabbed the green forest trees. Um, this is not new. This has been in the shop. <laughs> um, it was a little bit older. And then I was trying to pick other like wintry looking things. And I was like, I don't know. So then I have like my polar bear scarf. There's a hello winter, but I feel like this is blue. So the, <laughs> the snowman, we should grab the snowman. Even though he has a red scarf, there's still a snowman in the spread. So we should pick snowman. And then I just love the polar bear. I'm aware that there's no polar bear in Tahoe. There's not. <laughs> Maybe some California black bears. That's about it. 
Okay, there's my spread for the week of January 29th through the 4th. I think this may be the first week in January. We don't have a snow day. <laughs> um, and we're ending January and going into February, obviously. I really wish they would um, do something over here where it would say January slash February. Um, but they never do. <laughs> so so that is the feedback thing that I feel like we all need to put in the notes to Erin Condren whenever they do those surveys about the planners. So there's my spread. Loving the foiled snowflake adorable. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, let me know how your planner style is going for, for your first month of planning. Um, if you've still stuck with the same planner you started with, um, if you've changed up your spread designs or like shops you order from, I would love to know. So thank you guys so much and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.